WFNN. The Tiger Financial News Network. TFNN Headline News Update. Good morning, everyone. Basil Chapman for this Tiger Financial News Network. 10 o'clock uh, 10 o'clock market update. The Dow is up 18 at, uh, wow, that's really amazing. It did go positive, so it's eight, up 18 <clears throat> at 40,581. The S&P, S&P right now is down just three at 55.39. Uh, it's just stalling at this trend line resistance, but it's had a fabulous move up until now. QQQ, index 100 is trading uh, down a dollar thirty at four seventy three fifteen. Also, after a fabulous move, a little digestive phase right now. Looking at the uh, the IWM, that's the Russell two thousand. They were lagging a little bit, uh, but now they're coming on very strong, up a dollar seventy eight at two hundred thirteen point eighty five. Gold, uh, gold was very sharply higher. Now it's yep, it's still up thirty six. <clears throat> kind of breaking out of that trend line resistance. More importantly, we're looking at. Uh, the uh, crude oil <clears throat> down sharply, down 2.39, kind of struggling here at 70, uh, 76, 75, 77. And let's go to the TLT. That's the bonds. We'll go to the bonds themselves. Bonds are now up 10.30 seconds at 123 and 19.30 seconds. Kind of struggling, but they're in this range. The yields are kind of stuck in the range. And with that said, the volatility index is trading. We did a little bit with a little earlier, I did Tommy's show, so um, 1523 unchanged. Very interesting. Uh, most importantly, what we are looking at is the August the 5th, that Monday, that huge move to 65.75 in the, in the volatility index was an aberration. It just shouldn't have been there. And now we're starting to see a pullback uh, very sharp to the 200 period moving average trend line. So it's kind of normalizing right now. Okay, with that said, what, there was a question that came in. Oh, the SMHs. The SMHs, the semiconductors are down $1.54. They've had a fabulous move up. The nine period moving average just crossed positive for the first time. That's a good sign. So, uh, with that said, I'm going to be coming up with the Tiger Technicians Hour. Check out my opening call, my daily newsletter. We've had some really nice buys since the uh, August the 5th low. And uh, they're working even now as we speak. So, I'll be back for the Tiger Technicians Hour. In a few moments, hope you can stay.